Hello, good evening, this is Diecast Loon. I hope you're all doing well. And this evening's video is going to be this Matchbox 5 pack that I picked up earlier on today. And uh, it is pretty good news with that as I noticed when I was out and about that my local Tesco store has a massive influx of nine packs and five packs from Matchbox. So I'll be definitely going back there tomorrow. <coughs> Excuse me and possibly picking up another couple um, for tomorrow's video as I always do an unboxing video usually on a Monday but uh, anyway we're going to be taking a look at this one tonight and it is the MBX Highways 2 I believe I think it was from later on last year possibly I'm just having a look on the back for a date 21 might be, might be the beginning of this year. I'm not sure. Anyway, so it's the first I've actually physically seen of it. Um, I think I'd seen this being unboxed possibly on Whole Lotta Zep's channel. Rick from Whole Lotta Zep. I think he had this particular five pack. Anyway, we'll do our usual and we'll get straight into it. So we'll just take a look on the side. So as you can see, we've got uh, 57 GMC step side. We've got a 71 Pontiac Firebird. Uh, 33 Ford Coupe, uh, 2016 Chevy Camaro convertible, We've got the 51 Hudson Hornet. So some pretty cool pieces. So let's open this up without making too much noise if possible. If I can. He says with no noise. And let's get it open so we'll start off with the 57 1957 chevy step side in red <coughs> excuse me and it is a, i do like this cast and i must admit simple casting but i do like it it is a cool casting and uh, obviously released quite a few times now um just got a bit of leg you know, you've got a gmc on the side there which is pretty cool got the dog dish hubcap wheels and no rear or front tampos but that's all right as i said it is a cool little casting I'm gonna zoom out and i also have it in the white which i do really like with the black i know it wouldn't usually have a black it would be chrome or what have you but i do like the black i must admit and this is from a five pack um i think it's the relic five pack but uh i just thought i'd show it so that is pretty cool so that is a good start so i just put that to one side for a minute and then take a look at the i believe this is the 71 pontiac firebird i think it's formula <clears throat> so this is a cool piece i don't actually have any of these no i do that's a lie i have it in green somewhere but i haven't got it out to show but I do like this casting. So you've got. Just trying to see the plate. Yeah, so yeah, you can see it's got plate detail, which is a nice touch. Pontiac there. And obviously tampoed lights. And the front is all done in very nicely. So again, you've got the sort of lights are done. You've got the grill works done. So this is a nice casting. Only downfall to it is it has a chrome interior so i expect at some point i will have to strip this and give it a different color interior possibly a green or maybe a lighter like shade of blue like this and possibly put some uh, more period appropriate wheels but not for the minute so that is a pretty cool casting so that is number two out of the five and then we got the thing, it's the 33, is it the 33? Have a look. Yeah, 33 Ford Coupe. Again, very nicely done. And this awesome looking, like a, it's a bit like the same colour as that Matchbox Tesla they did. A sort of weird, I'm not quite sure, some sort of dark, very dark, sort of maroony red colour. But it isn't a matte paint. <coughs> Excuse me, it's a matte paint. And you've got the mud flicked up the sides. I have this in yellow somewhere, but at the moment it's put away. Hence why it's not out. 
I only really grab other doubles to look at if they're to hand. Um, a lot of my stuff is packed away, but this is a cool casting. Like I said before, it is a cool casting. And it always reminds me of the old sort of Bonneville salt flat racers. So that is a pretty cool piece too. And then I think this is the 2016 Chevy Camaro. So again, it's tampoed on the front lights. And you can see the little badge there. But they haven't done the grill for some reason. I don't know why, because that should have been, I would have thought, black. But still pretty cool. And obviously the back is done. So that is pretty cool too, with the usual matchbox five spokes that they do black interior so this is a cool piece as well so yeah 2016 which is 16 chevy camaro so very very cool and then I do like this hudson hornet it is a very nice casting a lot better in the chrome again no details on the lights or on the rear <clears throat> but this is definitely something I will be doing something with. I think I will be doing the little the lights on the roof and this little uh, siren horn and some rear details on this at some point. I think I will definitely be doing something with this. But this is a very, very cool piece. Probably my favourite piece out of the five. or well, the four others this is my favourite piece. So I think it says you've got Sheriff, MBX. So very very cool and again i have this in white as well so there's another you can see the like you see on the side that like rocket so again it's a very nice casting but i do prefer it in the black i must admit so very very cool so that is this evening's five pack and stay tuned for tomorrow as I might be, well, there's no might about it. I will be picking up another, possibly another couple of five packs. Might get a nine pack, I don't know yet, but like I said, there was a lot of choice there, so which is cool. And at some point in the near, very near future, I will be doing some detailing on the Hudson Hornet and an interior detail and we'll swap on this one and with that please like share subscribe and i'll see you all very soon thank you for watching and i'm back briefly i couldn't resist it as you can see i've done the lights in red on the top of the roof and the lights on the grill the chrome work there in red like they were and done the little search lights in chrome done the front headlights in chrome um done the rear lights quickly in chrome uh, chrome sorry red as well but uh, and i even did the little center caps on these cars had hudson or the hudson logo in the center and it was red so obviously i couldn't do that but uh, i did the next best thing and painted the hubcaps you can see the back ones are done as well but uh yeah it's not turned out too bad at all it's a bit a bit more detailed now so but anyway with that i'll see you all very soon thanks for watching